Yo, fellas! <laughs> it's your boy, GC. It's your man, GC, actually. I'm kind of getting older, so it's now it's not your man, GC. It's not your boy, GC. And um, thank you for, for looking, and thank you for uh, subscribing and supporting this channel. And um, I know there's a, a lot of guys, some guys, who really actually favor this channel. So, man, guys, I love you, man. I'm in the same struggle, and um, I have to deal with women as well. Um, I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm just being honest about it as a guy, and uh, I hope you guys feel like, well, he is trying at least to survive. At least this guy is trying to survive. <laughs> Jesus, hopeless. Okay, guys, so today I want to go into um, what you should do, because I'm going to give you three situations, what you should do when you get in a situation when a woman is denying you sex or she's not delivering the sex or she's not keeping up her promise it could be anything i'm gonna go into three situations i'm gonna play a little with them and explain and then it's over man <laughs> and then it's end of the fucking video end of the, this is end of the video <laughs> it's gonna be short let's go okay guys so this is typically typically a situation where you are uh dating a girl and you know our goals right like investing and you're like okay getting close getting close to some pussy okay but anyway at some point you're like doing a lot of investing and end of the evening's like I don't know. you 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 ah, ah, yeah I like the date and and I, I appreciate the the the, the 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 restaurant and I appreciate you 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 buying me uh I don't know anything and I appreciate you bring driving me home and I appreciate the hotel and I appreciate you you know whatever goes on and on like yeah bitch I have heard all the bullshit I appreciate it now comes but I I think you should sleep at home <laughs> so when that happens you know actually when that situation happens no way a woman with such an ugly voice but I mean in my mind they sound so fucking ugly when they're gonna tell me stuff like, that. like oh my fucking god this bitch is gonna tell me I'm not gonna have sex so when this shit happens and it can happen. <laughs> I've been through all this bullshit. You should actually respond something like this. Ah, oh, damn. Seriously? Oh, I just... I just got kicked out of my house. Because my girlfriend... Actually, I didn't tell you I got a girlfriend. But she just kicked me out. And, you know, I was already in a bad situation because... She, I was about to tell her about you and, you know, now I have fucking no place to stay, man. I just need, oh, honey, please, I will suck you. Soft, man. If you do exactly, you have to, did you watch the emotion? You really have to put it in. It's like, and then it comes and then you, you know, it saved you for the evening. Now we're going to another situation. This situation is that when you, when you're like in a, in a relationship with a woman, like, and they could also like, become sometimes like denying you sex or not you know really they're not on schedule anymore like they're not coming every on the two on the second day like honey it's time to suck your dick no it's like they forget about it they're becoming slobby you know they don't care about your dick anymore it's like Do you actually have a dick where where i don't see it where is your dick whatever you might get in a situation where a woman come up to like honey yeah Honey, I, uh, I'm getting a bit of a headache, and I'm a bit tired. I, I had a long day at work, and, and I, um, you know, I don't feel too good. I'm a bit, uh, tired, and, uh... Oh, yeah. Get it on. What do you want to say? Yeah, and I'm, and I'm, I think I'm going to go to bed, and I'm, and I think I'm going to sleep. What? I'm thinking I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm so and my my pussy hurts from the last five years of of not having sex. I really need to to get it in some kind of perspective with myself. And okay, shut the fuck up. This is how you should deal with this, man. This actually happens. Oh, you. I'm gonna tell you right now how you should deal with this shit. Because if you're in this situation, you should act like this. Oh, babe, that's fucking uh unpleasant i mean I, I hope you recover soon baby I mean, you need to sleep your pussy needs to heal from having no sex the last five years and i understand man. it's you need time to get it in perspective you know? 
So, um, could you like uh, drop your credit card at the uh, entrance because um, you know I don't got I don't got any credit to pay for the hooker. So we really appreciate. I paid for the last five years, you know. So last five years, you know. You know. And she's like, what? She's like, no, last five years, bitch. You know what happened last five years? And you're like, you got an excuse, man. You. Kick ass! Okay guys, so this is the third one. This is actually also like a dating situation. And um, you had a kind of a date, you're out there, and suddenly at a certain point this woman comes up. And you're like expecting like, okay, I'm gonna drive her home, I'm gonna get me some pussy. But at the end of the day, it's just like not kissing you and being like on a distance. And suddenly it's like, oh yeah, I like the date, but I would really appreciate if you would just drive me home and, and you can, you know, and then, no, we could meet another time because I'm really tired. And she already starts complaining when you're in the car or when you're at outside. And then, you know, definitely you have to act something like, okay, it's fine, um, but I'm not going to drive you home, so I'm going to call you a cab. And you start calling the cab and just put her in a cab and let the cab drive her home. And I'm just trying to say, make your point. I mean, this is actually... Don't take all the investments. Don't let all the investments you're doing for women when it comes to dating, all this kind of stuff. Don't let it go unrewarded. I mean, men need sex and women know about it. So if you are ex if you are being kind about it, they will keep abusing it. They will never give you sex. Have you ever come to a woman who will come to you like, oh yeah, you deserve sex. And she, then you don't even know her. I mean, they're not kind of spontaneously going to feel like they they feel like you deserve sex that you need to invest in them that's how they see it and then you will get something in return if you feel like i've done enough investments you uh you have you you demand sex you that's the return that's the deal don't let it go pass by like yeah i do a lot of investments in a lot of people and i don't expect anything i mean i am i'm just helping you out and don't need sex they're like a lot of guys who are like in this yeah, I'm just gonna help you out, and I don't need sex. I mean, I'm <laughs> what? Then you will never get sex. Like, <laughs> you need to, you need to, you need to put a little bit more pressure on it. Okay, guys, that was the, that was the video about what to do, what to do about women who are not delivering sex. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in the next episode.